Hi everyone and welcome back to our channel. So in this video, let's discuss about Order 14 Employee Appraisal. So providing appraisal for employees based on the service provided is an important aspect of any company's operations. The appraisal provides employees with satisfaction and recognition of the work for the services provided by them for a long time. So there are various uh, parameters and analysis to be done before the app on uh, every employee in a company. So to manage for managing employee appraisal, we have a separate module that is appraisal. So you have to install it from App Store. So this is interconnected to other human resource management aspects of Odoo. So here when you open appraisal module, you can see uh, we can filter this uh, employee appraisals by company and department. So you can see all the appraisal under a particular department and in a particular company. So you can see the appraisals in uh, company San Francisco under all department. And we can create new appraisal by just clicking on create button. So before that, when you go to configuration settings, Here we can set some settings uh, like appraisal plans. This is used to automatically generate appraisals. So here we can set confirmation email template that is automatic automatic email sent after confirming an appraisal. So for that uh, we can set email templates for employee and manager. Then here we can find option to ask a full survey to other employees. Then uh, here we can define uh, feedback templates. So we can configure feed feedback template by job. So they can see two templates that is one for employee feedback and other for manager feedback. So employee feedback is used to uh, evaluate that is to give, give feedback about uh, the services provided by the company for employee. So you can see some questions like does my company recognize my value? What are the elements that would have the best impact on my work performance? What are my best achievements since my last appraisal? So uh, the, this provides employees with satisfaction recognition of the work or services, uh, work for the services provided by them for a long time. So here you can see some questions. And for manager feedback template also, you can see. Uh, so this is used to evaluate the performance of employee, em employee by manager. Uh, what are the responsibilities that employee perform effectively? Uh, suggestions to improve that is given, suggestions that can be given for employee for improving his performance. So like this way, you can see some template. Okay. Then it is possible for configuring jobs like from here when you click on jobs. Okay, so after saving this, you can configure jobs. So this appraisal can be conducted uh, based on many four aspects. So appraisal can be done based on uh, many aspects like it can be just an evaluation that is complete evaluation evaluation is conducted on employee performance and operations within the company were uh, feedback on the employees obtained from managers, supervisory uh, staff. Then it is also a rating system where employees continuously rated on his performance. Then it is also possible for employees, uh, that is employees provide their own introspection based on input, that is self assistant assessments. And it is also possible to make a face-to-face -face interview uh, with the manager of or CEO of the company. Okay, so let's go back to our appraisal. And uh, from here, let's create a new appraisal. So from here, we can select the employee name. 
then when you select the employee automatically you can see uh, the manager of the employee job position so these these things are already uh, filled inside the employee form and here you can see the employee feedback template and manager template template then uh, here you can find an option to define employee goals that is user can define employee goals for the appraisal so under the goals menu so you can see here the name of the goal can be provided so here we can create a new goal Uh, so we can add the name of the goal and you can see the owner is auto uh, allocated based on the appraisal and here we can provide challenge by so this challenge by Annie John then here we can provide the progression of this goal uh, so if this uh, so here I'm providing 25 percentage and then there is a description box where we can provide description that can be customized. Um, okay, so you can save this and if this goal it is done, then you can mark it as done also. So here when you come back, you can see uh, it's a uh, progression. It is 25 percentage and here we can see the employee Antenna Oliver and it is uh, you can see our uh, message shown. You can only chat with employees uh, that have a dedicated user. So you have to create a user for, related user for this employee antenna. So in this way, you can create goals for this employee. So the goals and the uh, progression, the percentage of operations will be depicted. Uh, this will help the employees as well as managers to review the status of the appraisal operations being conducted under the company. And uh, here you can see option to plan meeting. So you can conduct interview or face-to-face -face meeting. Uh, so here you can see option to here you can see option to uh, create meetings directly from here. And if you create meetings, you'll be able to see the number of meetings planned. And now we can see the appraisal for this employee. It is to confirm, it is not confirm. So from here, it is possible to directly confirm the appraisal. So now we can see the appraisal is confirmed. And from here, we'll be able to see the newly created appraisal, confirm, confirm appraisal. Uh, so it can filter these appraisals according to to do, appraisals to do, then done appraisal, uh, then uh, my appraisals, then people or manage, then you can see late appraisals and you can also group it according to employee and status. And for this uh, appraisals, you can also find list view, uh, GAN view, calendar view, and it is also possible to schedule activities. So we can add new activity from here or we can just schedule it from here. You can see option to schedule activity. We can conduct interviews or calls. Okay, and uh, here we can also find a separate, uh, separate menu for viewing all the goals. So you can see the goals here and you can see the progression and number of days um, to complete goal then if you want to configure uh, more employees you can just come under configuration and can create and manage employees and one more thing is that here it is also possible to configure appraisal plans so here we can see uh, two appraisal plans created that is creating a new appraisal 
सिक्स मंथ आफ्टर लास्ट अप्रेजल और आफ्टर अरावल डेट सो लाइक दिस वे वी कैन क्रिएट मोर अप्रेजल प्लान so we can schedule appraisals then here we can see evaluation scale so this evaluation scale we can define create evaluation evaluation so here we can create evaluation scale and we can measure the uh, performance by that is by defining scales like uh, if you if anyone if an employee needs improvement or if employee meets expectations Uh, like this way we can define create evaluation scales then employee evaluation can also be done using surveys that is we can make use of survey module so when you install survey module uh, you can find that option like when you go to apps and remove you can see we have a module survey so you can see one more module that is appraisal survey so this is this appraisal survey is automatically enabled uh, when you enable 360 feedback option on your settings okay so let's install this one also so let's open our survey module and see how we can uh, define appraisal based on feedback or question surveys so you can see here we can create surveys so you can see the three stages and you can see all the surveys in progress so user can create new surveys having questions required to deal with that appraisal so it can be feed feedback survey of the survey to describe the performance by employee but based on their uh target achievements operation achieved so this helps to showcase the employee achievements of the empl uh, employment till the appraisal operations so here we can find a feedback form already created survey templates you can see feedback feedback form appraisal form like this way so when you click on this you can see already three answers are given so you can see all the questions here so it is possible to add questions uh, for your feedback form so you can add sections and you can divide it to divide questions to different sections then we can provide description for the survey so this survey uh, allows you to give feedback about your experience with our products and will help to improve your performance experience and here we can define uh, the layout uh, progression mode uh, like this way scoring method uh, then certification then we can also enable option like appraisal managers only so restriction can be uh, that is given that is we can restrict it to that is answers can be given only by managers when you enable this option so you can see already three answers are given so user can send it out to employees through mail or post link so we can just click on this share and directly from here we can set recipients and we can send this to employees or managers or we can just copy this uh, feedback form link and uh, here when you come back to our appraisal uh 
and when you open this uh, open an appraisal here we can find option to ask feedback so we can click on this ask feedback so we have enabled 360 feedback option in the, in our settings that is when you install it from app store it will be automatically enabled and here we can uh, add the survey template so you can select the survey template so okay, you can see feedback form and we can add recipients from here and then we can send so you can select employees add employees here and we can just click on send so you can see the body that is an appraisal feedback was requested please take time to fill the survey so you can set deadline and we can send it so you can see asked feedback now change to mishkarpin that is we have asked feedback to uh that is to fill feedback we have asked to an employee michel admin and you can see here a new tab here that is feedback survey so when you open this as we have sent the feedback to uh, that is ask feedback to michel admin you can see for michel admin it is possible to fill the feedback form so from here we can edit survey or back to appraisal and if the appraisal is done it can be moved to done state also then we have reporting so we can see the appraisal analysis of a particular year so we can see it as month wise week wise day wise or year wise and we can just click on this arrow to see the uh, next appraisal analysis you can see it is for next year, that is january 2021 and you can see it for january february like this way you can see you can change it by clicking this button and you can see the appraisal analysis of today and it is also possible to filter it according to appraisal sent then appraisal done creation date appraisal to be started then we can group it according to employee status department and date and we also have calendar view graph view and pivot view for viewing appraisal analysis and you can see option to insert the appraisal analysis report to spreadsheet so when you click on this it is possible to insert uh, this report appraisal analysis report to spreadsheet so you can change from here so that's all about employee appraisals in odo 40 If you are interested in knowing more about this or looking for any order implementation or customization in your business drop your request to order@cyprocess.com